Welcome back to San Antonio Living. Well, if you have a New Year's resolution to be more upbeat and positive this year, well, this next segment is definitely for you. Join us this morning with his keys to success and how to live life with enthusiasm is speaker and humorist Sonny Melendres. Good Leslie, morning. Happy New Year. Thank you very much. Happy New Year. You know, I've known you for, what, I think 14 years yes. now, a long, long time, and I've never seen you without a smile on your face. Oh, well, thank you. Thank so you. how do you... How do you do that? You know, I think that really what it amounts to is that what's inside has to come out. And a lot of times people only need permission mm -hmm. to have that come out. Everybody has a smile. And even if you don't have a smile, you at least have a grin, you know. And, and the neat thing about it is that it's there for everyone. And what if you're having a hard time, though, finding that grin within you? Well, that's where a sense of humor really comes in handy. And I've never been... Uh, you know, without that. In fact, mm -hmm. when I was five years old, uh, people asked me, what do you want to be? I said, I want to be a clown. You know, <laughs> so I, I've always gotten a lot of joy out of making people laugh. But having a sense of humor, you look at it, a lot of comedians draw from hard times mm -hmm. and, and make fun of that. And that's really what gets them through and what kind of gives them their style as well. You speak of hard times. A lot of people have a lot to be down about right yes. now. We all have struggles in our lives. There's a lot going on with the economy, um, some people without their health. What advice do you have for them? Well, I think this. We have determined, and this is nothing new. This goes way back to you know, the third century, that... Thoughts are things, and we are what we think about. So if you have a thought that's worry, anxiety, even mm -hmm. anger, all those, they do you no good. But the good thing about it is that the mind is the ultimate human computer. Mm -hmm. And so consequently, the mind can do what the computer can't, but the one thing that the mind cannot do is to have two thoughts at the same time. So if you replace the negative thoughts, mm -hmm. those thoughts that creep in, and get rid of those and replace them with a positive thought, it makes a big difference. And you can put the cart before the horse. Mm -hmm. Dale Carnegie said, if you want to be enthusiastic, act enthusiastic. Mm -hmm. After a while, that becomes who you are. And really, the word enthusiasm comes from two words. The Greek words, in, which means in, and theos, which means God. So to be enthusiastic means to have God within. And I want to say congratulations to Thank your new you. book, The Art of Living with Enthusiasm, 17 Stories of Encouragement, Comfort, and Joy. And I actually have the audio copy, yes. which is interesting that, I mean, that's the medium that you're probably most comfortable right, with, is, is right. speaking, being on the radio, being in front of people. Yeah, because you can listen to it in your car. And I've had a lot of people tell me that they've listened to it and they feel like they, they got more out of it because all of those stories that they heard, they can see it because radio and audio is a theater of the mind. So mm -hmm. consequently, while you're listening to it, you can see all these different pictures. And I know this up. is coming out in print, too. So Exa if you, if Kindle, you yeah. like to hang exactly. on to a book, then wait for that a bit. Oops, that was one of the words that people don't like to hear. <laughs> wait for it. Sorry about that. That's messed up. But we're going to show yeah. some pictures. Of <laughs> you're quick. We're going to show some pictures of just some, some monumental moments in your life. I know you meeting the Pope. What was that like and, and what can we learn from that? Well, really what you can learn from it is that, you know, whatever you see for yourself can come to fruition. This was an incredible story because I had a nun at St. Francis Academy who just walking into my car after I'd spoken to the student body, she said, if you're ever in Rome, our order of nuns takes care of the, of the Pope. Maybe we could arrange for you to meet the Pope. And so right at that moment, I thought to myself, I'm going to Rome. And that night, I met a airline executive who said, we have a new flight from Rome to New York. If you can think of a promotion, please let us know. Well, the next day, we gave him a whole proposal of taking letters from the children of San Antonio to the Pope, who was coming to San Antonio, so he'd know what was on their minds. And 60 days to the day from the time she said that to me, I was in Rome, and this picture was taken with, with Pope John Paul II. It's incredible. And, and again, I, I believe truly, in, uh, if you see for yourself what sometimes others can't see, mm -hmm. the universe comes to your party. And the universe actually helps. How many times have you had somebody say something to you and you say, I can't believe you're saying that. Mm -hmm. I just talked to so-and-so. Right. We're going to do this. Mm -hmm. Those are not accidents. The people you see, the people you meet, the people who call you, it all comes from what you send out. You've got to seize those moments. Exactly. We also have a picture of you and your mother because oh. you speak of your parents in yeah. this new book. Uh, you know, my mom was... She still is. She's, uh, she's going to be 90 oh, this wow. month. And, and she truly is 
the, you know, the heart and soul mm -hmm. of, of who I am with enthusiasm. She has an incredible, incredible outlook. I've never heard her speak ill of anyone. And, and she prays to these saints. She calls them her lawyers. So whenever I was growing up, uh, I had a, a problem. She said, oh, St. Jude, is in possible cases, he'll take care of his son. He'll take care of us. And he did. <laughs> and also, what's next for you? I see a collage of many smiling people that are very important in your oh, life. Oh, yeah. Well, this is the Sunny Melendres Community Center, and this is very near and dear to my heart. We have so many kids on the, uh, the west side of San Antonio who are disadvantaged, who are, uh, in many cases, you know, don't have all the advantages that so many other children have. So to bring those resources to them makes a big difference. But I'd like to do a television program that puts the spotlight on people all around the world who are doing great things that maybe are unsung heroes mm -hmm. who are using their enthusiasm to change the world. If anyone can do it, it's you. <laughs> so let us Thank know you. when you have that announcement. I will. I will. All right. And in the meantime, we can all get a copy of your audio book. And when is it coming out in print? It'll be out in print next month. Okay, yeah. so there you go. Of course, we can let you know how to get more information by going to Sunny's website, which is really fun to check out. You have a very nice oh, website. SunnyMelendrez.com is where you can go to learn more about Sunny, his advice, his inspiration, also how to get a hold of his book. You can call 887-9850 for more information. It's great to see you. Happy Thank New you. Year to you. All right, coming.